Getty cabinet ministers fear Jacob Rees-Mogg would beat Theresa May in a leadership contest Senior government sources have revealed that ministers believe supporters of the popular backbench MP who has emerged as the darling of the party are maneuvering to ensure he wins a possible leadership contest in the coming months even though he has strongly denied harboring ambitions for the job. The Daily Express has also learned that UKIP members are being approached to join the Conservative Party by supporters of Mr. Rees-Mogg in the hope it could ensure his victory. A former UKIP parliamentary candidate said, It is certainly an attractive idea. With the Tories in the state, they are in only around 70,000 members. We could help make sure Jacob wins and Britain has a real Brexit Prime Minister. The revelation has come as supporters of Boris Johnson and Michael Gove have let it be known that they want to strike a deal with Mr. Rees-Mogg to join them in a Brexit dream team, making him the new Chancellor. The Prime Minister needs to understand that we can take back control. A leading Eurosceptic speculation over the leadership has been rife in recent weeks after reports that Sir Graham Brady, the chairman of the 1922 committee, which represents Tory MPs, has received almost the 48 letters required to trigger a vote of no confidence in Mrs May as leader. A cabinet minister also accused Mr Johnson of planning a coup to become prime minister. Pro-Brexit MPs have become increasingly concerned over whether Mrs May will deliver a clean Brexit which will end Brussels rule in Britain and allow it to have an independent trade policy. Over the weekend a leading Eurosceptic said the Prime Minister needs to understand that we can take back control. GETTYA cabinet minister also accused Boris Johnson of planning a coup to become Prime Minister. If she persists with this customs union plan, we can get rid of her and we have the numbers to ensure that one of us takes over. Mr Johnson has reportedly also privately told supporters that while he wants them to rally round Mrs May, he is ready for a future contest. Under the three Brexiteers plan he Mr Gove and Mr Rees-Mogg would lead the government with senior jobs found for Pretty Patel and Dominic Raab. But for many on the Brexit wing of the party, Mr Rees-Mogg has emerged as the frontrunner and is now the bookie's favourite. The only thing preventing the MP4 North East Somerset winning is believed to parliamentary arithmetic, with Tory MPs getting to choose the two of the number who were presented to members for a final vote. Getty M. R. Rees-Mogg has recently taken over as chairman of the European Reform Group. A senior minister told the Daily Express, We are determined to keep the Prime Minister in place at least until Brexit is negotiated. As things stand, colleagues are afraid that we would have a Prime Minister Rees-Mogg if there is an election before. Another minister added, If he got to the last two, I'm sure Jacob would win. The members adore him. His main problem is that he probably does not have enough support in the parliamentary party to get that far. However, Mr. Rees-Mogg has recently taken over as chairman of the powerful group of pro-Brexit MPs, the European Reform Group UG, where he has already impressed colleagues. Friday, February 2, 2018 The moment Jacob Rees-Mogg is confronted by a masked man 1. MP on the group said, We absolutely love Mogg. He's tremendous. So articulate, so polite, such a powerful debater. Many of us would like to see him as leader. Last night Mr. Rees-Mogg denied reports he had been approached by supporters of Mr. Johnson and Mr. Gove to form a Brexit dream team with the offer of being Chancellor. He said, the first I knew about it was when the journalist who wrote the story called me about it. It is understood that Mr. Mogg is privately upset by reports that he had a heated showdown with the Chief Whip Julian Smith and had called for the civil servant in charge of Brexit Olive Robbins to be sacked. Sources close to Mr Mogg believe that the spin is being put out by his opponents on the Remain side of the argument. It is understood that the meeting with Mr Smith was extremely courteous and friendly, while Mr Rees-Mogg has not called for Mr Robbins to be sacked although other MPs at the same meeting did he call for the senior civil servant to be replaced.